Outlander Season 6 Episode 7, Sticks and Stones, the Fraser family has to deal with the fallout of Malva's murder as the community begins to suspect Claire is behind her death. Meanwhile, Lizzie has some seriously unexpected news that involves her and both of the Beardsley twins. Eve, oh my god, the penultimate episode of Outlander Season 6 and what an episode it was, what did you make of it? I love this episode. There was a lot going on um, and I think it really sets up what's going to be an amazing finale. Yeah, absolutely. Definitely some major storylines I was not expecting there. Um, the biggest one being the side plot going on with Lizzie and the twins. And we're very lucky to be joined by the actor who actually plays the Beardley twins, Paul Goldman. Paul, welcome so much to Outlander Insider. Thanks so much for joining us. No, thank you so much for having me, guys. It's an absolute pleasure. Um, episode seven for the twins. Oh my God. Like yeah. I haven't personally read the books and I did not see that coming. Did you not see it coming? Oh wow. I did not see it coming. <laughs> so like, what was your reaction reading the script? I mean, did you know, that, did you know for a long time that this is where things were headed with Lizzie? Well, that's really interesting you say because a lot of the people that I've talked to have been fans of the book, so they know that it's coming. So it's really interesting to see you guys who have not seen, I've not read <laughs> the books, but just seen the episodes and then having that kind of information come at you. So I knew it was um, on the horizon, so to speak, um, and I knew it was coming. And uh, yeah, it's, and we're really, really kind of pleased with how it's kind of ended up. Um, it's really kind of lovingly showed uh, the, the two marriages that we have. Um, we're just kind of really, really chuffed with how it's uh, played out. I mean, I was just going to say that, like, um, like you said, it's like a, a really, it's done in a really loving way. And something I yeah. really like about the character's response to it is that, like, no one's embarrassed. Like, kind of watching yeah. it, you're like, ah! and it's like they're just like, it's, it's it literally just feels like the norm. It's yeah. love. I know that's the thing that we're kind of thinking about when we're going into it is like, would they be aware that it is quite controversial? And we probably do. And that's why when Jamie confronts them, they do feel a bit of kind of guilt and remorse towards like feeling like they would kind of betrayed their trust. But to them, it is just, it's love. It has their the relationship has foundations and like, you know, adoration, admiration um, and respect for each other. So they don't see it as uh, that they've committed some sort of like kind of sinful or like wrong acts. They see it as a like they love each yeah. other so much and they want to be with each other so much. So why else would it be seen as anything else? You said you knew going in the storyline because you obviously checked out the books. Uh -huh. What was it like when you and Caitlin O'Ryan, who plays Lizzie, came together and was like, "Look, we've got this storyline coming up next season or this season." What What did you say to each other? We we, we just kind of had a focus on just making it as authentic as possible and kind of focusing on just the fact that they were in love. Um, and we wanted to kind of have a kind of foundation between both twins as well, because in the fifth season, we kind of mainly see Josiah because Kezi um, has just came from the farm. He's been very sick and malnourished. So he's kind of resting and tending to his kind of, to his health. So we kind of focus on Josiah in the fifth season. So for this season, um, we had a, a conversation with Matt and Marl who have been so supportive towards us, the producers, um, and kind of focusing on building up Kezi's relationship with Lizzie as well, just so they both feel kind of balanced and mm. um, that, as I say, like there's a foundation for their love for all three of them as well. Fraser's Ridge is absolutely, like, it is a cosmopolitan town. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, I've never heard of really it great time like that. There. That's so accurate. It's a cosmopolitan <laughs> town. <laughs> Do you see Kaziah, Josiah and Lizzie's relationship lasting the test of time? You know, it's, like you said, it's very unique, but how yeah. are people going to react to it when it comes out? That is a good question. Um, I think it will. I think it will. I think because it is just based on on love and the kind of like taboo of the relationship that they are, they will kind of fight for it. And they're like, they're, they're all kind of really resolute characters, especially um, especially Lizzie and Caitlin plays her so well in this season with that kind of strength and kind of kind of power. Um, that I could definitely see them kind of stand in the, the, kind, of, the kind of test of time. They, they do, in the books it mentions that they kind of have to keep their marriage a secret, that um, uh, Josiah is just the, 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 the crazy uncle that lives in the, <laughs> lives in the cabin. <laughs> um, but I, I, do, I do see it kind of stand in the test of time, especially with the arrival of, um, 
of um of the baby as well um liz is mm. now pregnant as well so uh so i think that will that will kind of bring them even closer together logistically for you you're you're doing a whole the parent trap situation here yeah. where obviously you're playing you're playing both twins like tell us a little bit how that works i watched a lot of Lindsay lohan uh, I... <laughs> inspiration number one yeah oh, oh absolutely for everything um <laughs> So yeah, I think that was a big thing coming into it. I've never, I mean, I've, it was my first ever screen job as well. And, and the, the fact I was playing two characters, I was just so grateful to kind of get that opportunity. And going into that, I didn't have kind of any understanding and how that would work. So I did watch, I did watch a lot of like actors have done it before, like Tom Hardy, Lindsay Lohan, um, the kind of behind the scenes footage that they do have and how like the kind of visual effects actually works. A lot of them, um, a lot of tennis ball acting so you're like kind of focusing on on um like kind of like focus points so like i'm pretending that somebody's there um we had uh two two uh doubles that i worked with uh dylan on the the, the fifth season and then daniel at the end of the fifth season the, and for this season as well and they're love they're brilliant actors as well so they're giving me like brilliant performances that i actually i just steal from them to be honest and uh, can kind of recreate that um, so it was a lot of like a lot of like kind of teamwork. Um, we do have to kind of focus a lot of time doing it as well because it is a lot of um, a lot of kind of like magic that we're doing. Um, but it's been it's pulled off kind of kind of well. It, it looks good on screen, so that, I think that's that's all that matters. And again, that kind of authenticity was something that we were kind of we were definitely after. Speaking of next week's episode, obviously it is the season finale. Without giving too much away, what can you tell us about it? Oh, um, it's it's a it's a it's a thrilling episode. It's really what 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 has been so good about this season is that we're focusing a lot on a community, a community, and how it like kind of like thrives, how it like expands, the kind of turmoil within a community, and the way that this season has been panning out. This community is coming to a boiling boiling point as well with the kind of arrival of the Fisher folk and the Christies. And I can say that that kind of boiling point kind of climaxes in a kind of really spectacular way. Oh, thank you so much for joining us for another episode of Outlander Insider. Don't forget to like and subscribe and please leave your comments. We love reading them and we will see you next week for the finale. Bye.